What's up guys? Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are, whatever time it is. Thank you for joining us for another adventure. McKinnon and I, we're getting ready to start. Can you tell where we're at, huh? Indianapolis Airport. We're heading south to Florida for the uh, All-Star All -Star, All -Star World Cheer Competition in Orlando. So come along. This is going to be day one. This is going to be travel and arrival, and we'll see where we end up. Boom, like I said, we're just getting started. Um, it's just Mac and I as, as we've got puppies at home, so mommy had to stay home and the boys have sports stuff going on and are staying home. This is going to be kind of a daddy-daughter trip. And it should be good. So hopefully we still have a good time. We'll miss everybody for sure, but we're going to make the best of it. All right, we got through TSA. We had to go through Concourse B TSA because Concourse A TSA, something going on with it. So we went over to B. Now we're making our way over to Concourse A. And then we'll find our gate, and we'll chill and wait, and and uh, we'll be on one of these. Almost the very last one. There's maybe one more passenger behind us getting on the plane. You sight? Why? Because you sit by yourself. <laughs> It'll be all right. That's part of the event. We won't be that far. Gate number eight, three. If you and plus, there's like three or four children on this plane. We'll be out. What would you say? I think we should just go home. Oh no, you got it. This is the best part. No, we won't be sitting together on the way back either. I don't like. We'll see. I'm not sure. I don't know nothing about these phones. How you put it on the airplane mode? So did you survive the flight by yourself? Yes. So who were you sitting? Window, aisle, or middle? Middle. <laughs> the one seat I didn't want to I totally got the window seat. <laughs> it was awesome. Um, did you end up sitting with, with guys or girls? Uh, there was one girl, she slept the whole time, and then there was one guy who was just on his laptop the whole time. Nice. Easy peasy, right? Yeah. Yep. It wasn't too bad. I read the whole time. Did you? Nice. Yeah. So smart. Studious. Alright, let's go pick the restroom up and then go find a rental car and get out of here. Da, 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 da. Getting on the tram, getting on the tram. So let's go. Yeah. yeah, we don't have to go through there. No, we don't have to go that way. Yeah, we did last we go year, didn't we? this way. Boom. What are you whining about? She got us a Corvette. She got a Corvette? Yeah. Alright, now we gotta figure out where we're going. Um, that's ticket, bag, and parking. Yeah. Parking, parking, let's go, let's see. Escalator to parking. What does it say, parking? Right there. Parking, three, two, one. Parking three, that's us. Open! Right, let me see what section. Hold on. For row C, look for a super boring looking white SUV. It's not that one. Right? No. That, one that one's super cool. Uh, let's see. That one? No. Or this one? I don't know. Where's the numbers at? There's numbers. Yeah, there should be numbers. You sure? All right, now oh, yeah, we know, yeah, place. now we know where we're going. Now we know, okay. This we gotta turn around for a second. 
But now we know where we're going. McKinnon led us horribly astray at first. <laughs> All right, so we're looking for terminal seat parking. That's not anything we've ever had to do. And you actually got to get on a train, another tram, to get over to terminal seat parking. So this is the first time we actually had to ask somebody, but they pointed us in the right direction. And it looks like uh, we're going to be hopping on this train. All right, we found terminal C parking. It's all new. That's why we've never been here. That's why I was super thrown off. We went to find it. All right, now we're looking for row 66. The most 67. boring white SUV that you can find, sis. This way, door. This way. That's embarrassing. This is row 66. 66. So somewhere in this row. Oh, what is that? What is what? Is that Fiat? Oh, let's look at it. Have you ever seen one of those? No. Don't touch it. I know. It looks like this is an expensive car, and you can tell. Does it look cool? I like it. What if That's I so told cool. you that was our car? No, it's not. Yeah, it is. That's our car. No, it's not. That's hilarious that you stopped. No, it's not. You stopped and pointed no, out. No, it's not. It <laughs> yeah. is? Yeah. Oh, yeah, boy. No, it's not. You're joking. <laughs> yeah. No, that's me and you. <laughs> Fiat Spider, man. <laughs> yeah. Ooh. I knew you'd get a super car with just the two of us. <laughs> All right. Well, let's uh, check this bad boy in. I got a... Fiat Spider? Yeah. Yeah, it's called the Fiat Spider convertible. All right. I got to jump off here. I got to check us in on Turo, and then uh, we're going to take off. All right, we're getting in the car. This was the one car, no joke, as we were walking through the parking lot. McKenna literally stopped and pointed at it and said, look at this car, what is that? And I said, that's our car. And she's like, what? No way. And now she's literally sitting outside waiting on me to start it. Yeah. <laughs> she is so stoked. I knew this would make the trip. Definitely the best part of everything so far. What do you think? This is so cool. This is pretty cool, huh, bud? <laughs> well, dad and mom, come to the, come to the win here. I love All cars. Right. This is so cool. All right, let's see if, well, number one thing, we're in Florida and we're in a convertible, so we gotta figure out how to drop this top. Here. All right, let's see. Oh, yep. Oh. Watch your fingers. Boom. <laughs> now we are open airing it. Let's, let's, go. let's go. You ready, dude? Wait, I need to whip my hair up or something. Okay, yeah, because it could get a little cray. Alright. What's up, guys? We are on 417 in Orlando in the drop top convertible spider. Head to Disney Springs, baby. Woo! Woo! Disney World, the most magical place. <laughs> Alright, guys, we just got to Disney Springs. McKinnon, what do you think of the car? I love it. It's pretty awesome. The drive over was pretty sweet. Definitely a great surprise. Were, did you expect this at all? No. No. Like I said, this was so funny. We were walking through the garage, and this was the one car McKenna literally stopped and goes, what is that? And I'm like, that's literally our car. That's what that is. <laughs> all right, now we're on the rooftop of Orange Garage. We're getting right head down and into Springs. So, Sis, what are you thinking on food? Uh, Try that burger place if you want to, or we can go to Chicken Guy. Nothing like coming down the escalator into Disney Springs. All right, guys, we're trying to figure out what to eat. I think since it's right as we walk in, really easy to get to, and delicious. I think we're gonna go Chicken Guy. It's always winter. We're doing Chicken Guy. We just want the classic. Uh, let's see here: five piece tenders and brown sugar barbecue and special sauce and fries. Their fries here are awesome. Um, we're just going to split this meal and then move on and go find some good Disney Spring snacks. Maybe go do some shopping. Uh, just chill out till we got cheer practice later tonight, but we got a couple hours to kill. We just finished up lunch, a little chicken guy. Now we're just taking in the ambiance of Disney Springs. And we're going to go try to track down one of McKenna's friends and another cheerleader down here. We'll go see if we can find her. See what they're up to and, and uh, we'll go from there. Looking for cheerleader friend. Looking at the balloon. 
Oh, man, it's nice down here. It's like 88 oh, yeah. degrees and the shade is perfect because there's a little bit of a breeze. A little bit of breeze. But in the sun, it is warm. We still haven't found our friends yet, but we are getting dangerously close to... Wait a minute. Don't whip it. It's right this way. Past the giant T-Rex. Oh, that's not a T-Rex. What is that? That might be a T-Rex. Huh. Past the Lego store. Okay, we just got the word she's in the Lego store. Let's go, let's go. Behind the dragon. And walk off all that chicken guy. All the other snacks. She found her, she zoned in. He found it. Right, we met up with our old Hoosier friends and now we're back on the hunt just exploring. I think we're gonna head into the World of Disney store right there. Go do some shopping, maybe go look for some new pins so we can do some pin trading. All right guys, we just stopped and grabbed a birthday pin because it's McKenna's birthday here in just a couple weeks, a couple days, a couple weeks, less than two yeah. weeks. Almost a birthday, so we'll get that, rock that all through Disney Springs. That kind of brings along some happy birthdays from, that adds a little magic. Happy birthdays from the staff, you never know. Um, little touches of magic, little little things might happen when you have a birthday pin on, so it's always cool to put one on, um, yeah, as long as it's your birthday, or near your birthday, and see what happens. All right, so we stopped and got our first Disney purchase. We went ahead and grabbed pins because McKenna is a pin trader. We love pin trading while we're down here. Add some adventure to the trip. Um, the key to pin trading is go in and buy the cheapest that you can buy, and then use those to trade off to find the good ones. Right, sis? Mm -hmm. And McKenna's already got one happy birthday from a Disney cast member, so that was cool. I'm telling you, happy birthday, happy birthday, Finn. You gotta do it. And we're almost to our next destination, which is that building right over there. That is our Dole Whip stop, but we get to walk by the Rainforest Cafe where we're going. Maybe we'll get a little uh, volcanic eruption while we're over there. Waiting on a Dole Whip, waiting on a Dole Whip, waiting on a Dole Whip. Got a Dole Whip, got a Dole Whip, got a Dole Whip. Yeah, boy, Disney. How was this first bite? Good. Excellent as always. All right, now we got the snack. We are going to eat on the way, on the walk. We're gonna go grab the car, head back to my Uncle Rick's house, get changed up and get ready for practice tonight. Dole Whip in the bag. It was delicious. Now we're heading back towards the car, but we get to walk down this little shopping strip here and there's one stop we know we wanna stop by and that's Pele Soccer up here on the left. McKinnon's needing some new cleats. We've kind of been holding off because we knew we were going to be here in Disney Springs. And uh, we'll see if we end up finding any here at Pele Soccer. What's up, buddy? All right, brother, how are you? You guys are cool. All right, so we are no-go on the soccer cleats. There's some cool stuff in there. We got to sit there and watch Man City play for a minute. That's always awesome. Um, got to see De Bruyne score. That was cool. Um, but no-go on the cleats. There's not a huge selection at stores. Store's really cool when it comes to, like, jerseys and stuff, but not a lot of cleats. So now we're just grabbing Everglazed. I'm going to grab one of our favorite donuts for after practice tonight once we get back to the house. And uh, so that'll make a good late-night snack. Everlays, if you like donuts and you're in Disney Springs, make sure you come to Everlays. Right next door to Splitsville. Splitsville, we played, uh, I don't know if it's gonna say a round of bowling, but that's obviously not a round of bowling. But we played a couple games of bowling in there um, as a family a couple years ago. That was really cool. All right, Everglades. Maple bacon donut, here we go. We just walked out of Everglades, and I know we we're only gonna go maple bacon, but bam. Bonus donut. Bonus donut. You guys will have to wait. Stick around to the end. We'll finish up the night once we get back from practice. We'll have the big reveal. What did we get? Was it a, a cinnamon streusel? Apple streusel? Is it a, a cookies and cream donut? I don't know. Could be anything. We'll, uh, we'll just have to see. Okay. We totally come up the wrong set of stairs. Instead of walking under this in the shade, we come up down there. And we're actually parking way down there. So, it comes in handy to actually know where you're going. What has been a year since we've been here? 
We'll make it. We will make it. We ended up leaving Disney Springs earlier and then went back to my Uncle Rick's house for a little bit to take a little bit of a break. And then we just went to McKenna and had practice tonight, her last practice before the big competition. And now we're on our way back to uh, head back towards Uncle Rick's house. We might have to swing by and grab something to eat. But uh, just loving every second of this driving in the old uh, convertible top down. Still mid 90s, mid 80s down here in Florida outside of Orlando. Uh, just a ton of fun. Just enjoying every second of it. We stop and grab supper at the old Chick fil A's. It's always good. So now we're going to swing on back to Uncle Rick's, eat supper, cash out for the night. I'll get ready. Ooh, there we are. I'll catch up with you when we get back. Yeah. Chick fil A. Always good. I almost forgot, and I pretty much did forget. I forgot to show you our bonus donut. There's honestly not much left. We just got back. We finished up our Chick Fil A, and me and McKenna dug in for dessert. S'mores, s'mores donut. That's pretty awesome. Real good. The old Everglades never fails. And that's gonna wrap up our video for tonight, guys. So thanks for coming along with us today, and we'll see you tomorrow.